Well, good Friday morning, everybody. Hi, I'm Phil Kincaid for the Nashua Telegraph with our favorite meteorologist, Al Caprillian. And then, of course, we missed Al the last uh, couple of, uh, last week or so because we had some technical difficulties. We apologize for the, for that. Al is back, ready and raring to go. He's got a lot of weather that's built up over the last week. And so coming in today, it's kind of wet out there. Al, how long is this, uh, this little inclement going to last with, with us? All right, Phil. Well, we can't control computers, which caused the technical problem last week and uh, the last couple days, and we can't control the weather. But it looks like we will see a wet Friday today as low pressure moves up along a stalled cold front. Remember, a cold front came through a few days ago. It stalled off of the New England South Coast. Low pressure moving along it. We will see period of steady rain today, only in the mid to upper 50s for high temperatures. Patchy fog around. Tonight, there'll be some occasional rain, drizzle, areas of fog tonight, upper 40s to around 50. And for Saturday, tomorrow, we should see a mostly cloudy day. There will be some scattered showers, not as steady rain as uh, Friday. Scattered showers, areas of drizzle on Saturday, low 60s with the wind off the cool ocean. Sunday, we'll see a scattered shower, areas of drizzle. It'll be a mostly cloudy day, low to mid 60s, a few degrees milder filling everyone with a southerly wind Sunday. And then the upper level low pressure system from New York State will approach. A second coastal storm may try and get going to our south. But that upper level low in New York State will bring another round, possibly with some steady rain, if not late in the day, Sunday, Sunday night, into the morning commute Monday. And then after that, we'll dry out. So uh, we have to get the upper level low from New York State to move east. And that could bring a little bit more steady rain late in the weekend. But aside from that, it does not look like a complete washout. There'll be a lot of dry periods on Saturday and Sunday mixed with a scattered shower or drizzle. But today, Friday, looks like the wettest day, Phil of the next couple. So welcome to fall. It's here. Yeah, so not a lot of sun this weekend, huh? Not much. Uh, there may be a little bit well inland away from the coast. We're going to have that onshore wind bringing moisture in off the ocean. The further inland you go, if not Saturday, there could be a break or two of sun Saturday or Sunday, but the best chance will be well inland. Uh, nothing like the sun we had on Thursday. Uh, yesterday when we had all that blue sky. So uh, not a complete washout this weekend, but not as bright as many of the weekends have been in the past. Well, that's okay, Al, because we've had a lot of great weekends all summer long and into the early fall, so we really can't complain, can we? I guess we can't complain. It was a great summer. We had a lot of humidity, great beach days, and now fall is there. But, uh, you know, we'll see uh, Monday morning if we have any moderation temperature next week. We'll see. We still can get in the 70s. I've even seen 80 degrees, low 80s in October. So the real warm weather, the hot weather's gone, but I've seen warm weather filling everyone in October. Yeah, amazing. Here it is. We are going to hit October next week. Thank you very much, Al. We'll you talk, have we'll talk to you October 1st, Monday morning. That's right. Take care. Bye-bye.